Hi everyone, this is Brian with Anderson Pens and today we're gonna to take a look at the new offerings from ST DuPont. Let's take a look. Okay, so here we have some of the examples in the DuPont D initial line. This is uh, DuPont's sort of entry level point uh, and they have some really, really nice patterns here. They're fairly conservative. We've got your black and palladium, uh, black and gold, uh, my favorite uh, by far, the matte black with this brushed steel finish. And uh, these are all twist ball points, but it's got, you can see the brushing actually on the, on the clip, which is real nice. Um, we've got a metallic pearl white with gold trim. And we've also got this really bright, friendly orange. Now these pens are all available, fountain pen, rollerball, or ballpoint, I just have a few examples here. We can take a look at the fountain pen and the palladium. We've got the, uh, the logo on the clip there, and uh, the clips have a fairly good springiness to them. We've got the D initial on the top of the cap. ST DuPont are on the wide cap band. And these, of course, are friction fit caps. So on the D initial, we have stainless steel nibs. Let's take a look at the feed here. It's a plastic feed. These are all cartridge converters. So we just unscrew the barrel. There's a cartridge in there, there's a converter in the box. Nice, uh, the, in the D initial, not really designed to post. So the lo longer barrel makes it a little bit easier to hang on to. We've got a metal section here. Nice, nice weight. And of course on the nib, we've got the D inside the, sh the shield. So roller ball, basically the same thing. Now the DuPont does use a proprietary roller ball refill. while the ballpoint uses a Parker style, has this nice metal sleeve in here, it gives it a little extra weight. Twist it shut. And then it's a twist to activate. And again, there's, that, there's the clip. So if you're gonna put this one in, in your pants pockets or something, you've got, you've got quite a bit of room there before anything's gonna happen. The spring clip is very, very nice. Um, so you've got a couple different colors. We can take a look at the metallic pearl. Really a lovely pearl white finish with this gold accent. Really a lovely, lovely color. And let's take a look at this one again. Really a cool, cool pattern. That's really, and it's kind of a soft, it's, it's a matte finish, so it's a little bit soft in the hand. So this is really a nice option. So that's the D initial. Next up, we're gonna look at the Defi. All right, so here is the Defi. This is a completely different animal. Um, looking at the ball points here, this has a very interesting design. It has sort of a, like an overlay over the top of the lacquer. So you can kind of see how it's indented here. Uh, so it's thin here, and then the overlay gives it a little bit of girth. So these are the ball points, your twist, I've got the black with the palladium trim, and it's got a little bit nicer uh, jewel on the top here with the DuPont D. Um, it's got a really, really wide spread on this spring clip here, so this is really nice if you have thicker, thicker shirts or you're gonna tuck it in your pants pocket, um, jeans pocket, really nice. I like this one, uh, and again, uh, their matte black is really excellent. Um, like the D initial I showed earlier, this one has like a dark ruthenium trim with that same matte black, soft, uh, soft finish. Really a really a cool looking pen. And of course these, just like the D initial, have this long metal sleeve. And then we've got Parker style refill. So you can use your favorite refills in there. Just a unique design. 
that you don't see on, on pretty much any other pen. And that's the defeat. Okay, here are some examples of DuPont's line D. Now the line D is their top of the line writing instrument. Uh, so we've got a couple examples here. I've got a lot of fountain pens. Uh, this one here is really a cool, cool pattern. This is called the Windsor. So it's black with this metal striping up the side, which is really pretty cool. Um, metal section. And Line D all uses 14 karat gold nibs. Um, the pens are designed to post. In fact, they have a little secure posting nub there, similar to other pens, Schaefer 300, things like that, um, where it snaps on a place and you can't really, you can't shake it off, um, which is really nice. Uh, got a nice taper to the barrel. So you can do it unposted, posted, it puts that, that weight a little bit further back. The nibs have, uh, we've got our shield here, the DuPont logo, 14 karat underneath it. A little bit different feed than what's on the D initial. This one's got a little bit more of a comb style, it's still a plastic feed. And then inside we've got cartridge converter. International, so you can use all your, your favorite international cartridges. DuPont logo there again. Clip is a little bit different than the D initial. We've got a little bit larger logo here, and if we bring back one of the D initials, we can see that a little bit of a difference. So we've got a ridge up the middle on the line D. So that's the Windsor, and of course it's in the ballpoint version as well, and on the ballpoint, when you twist it, it lines up, which is kind of cool. The uh, cap jewel is a little bit different, a little bit different from the Defee, but it's a little bit more three-dimensional with the, uh, the D logo on there. Here we've got, this is a standard black and palladium. Now on the line D, DuPont makes two sizes of fountain pens. They have a regular and then they have a large. Um, this is the large version. This is the rollerball. But we've got a ribbed section here. Cap snaps onto place. So the ribbing actually makes a metal section really, if you don't like metal sections, this ribbing really takes away any chance that you're gonna, you're gonna slip. Let's take a look at the fountain pen here. So there we have this nice, beautiful section, the rhodium plated 14 karat gold nib. Again, it's a cartridge converter. And the DuPont logo lines up with the nib in this case, which is nice. But it's got that classic DuPont click to it. So over here I have two other fountain pens these are the standard size. So you can see them next to this one I have here. This is the large and this is the kind of the standard size. So I've got this beautiful metallic pearl, very similar to the D initial ballpoint that we showed earlier in gold trim. And we've got a gold, solid gold nib here with a plain section. So no ribbing on this. But again, your DuPont logo lines up nicely. And it posts very nice. And again on these, we have a really nice spring clip here. So once you post that cap, that cap is not coming off unless you drop the pen. This is one of the most beautiful ones I've seen. Uh, a blue guilloche, it's kind of a dark bluish gray, smoky blue pattern. Reminds me a lot of the Mont Blanc Blue Hour from a few years ago. Uh, again, plain metal section with uh, the 14 karat rhodium plated DuPont nib. You can just see the attention to detail when they make these, how they line everything up. And this one is just gorgeous. This is the 
lacquered, the blue lacquer, the atelier is what they call it. And you can see blue, it's like a marbled, very dark marbled blue and black on the finish. Uh, DuPont's famous for their lacquer finishes and uh, when you see this, you, you know why. It's just gorgeous. Uh, this is a large size. And on the large here, we've got the ribbing on the section. We've got the large nib with the DuPont logo and then the shield, 14 karat. You've got your comb feed. It's still got a little bit of a, a elegant scoop to it there. And again, cartridge converter, but larger, much larger size. Very nice unposted. Again, you can post it, it snaps into place. It causes the balance to go tip a little bit further back. Um, but unposted, it's really near perfect. It's very, um, very nice, nice weight, nice balance to it. And that feeling of that lacquer is just, just wonderful. And it clicks on real nice. So there you have it. These are the line D from DuPont. So there you have it. The new offerings from ST DuPont. Be sure to check us out online at andersonpens.com or our stores in Appleton and Chicago. Thanks for watching.